There, oh boy, that's a big Whoa. fish. Big fish. Welcome to Fishing with Latin with Latin Langman and co-host Steve Ronholt. You can buy that expensive tackle that you think that you might need. You can head out for the river and hope you might succeed. But if you want to fish just right, just turn your TV on. Come on, fish with Latin, he'll get your fishing on. Yeah, come on, fish with Latin, and you'll have some fun. Catch some fly in Alaska on the wild Yukon, or catch some trout and salmon in good old Washington. Fishing with Latin, casting with Latin, man, that's a lot of fun. Fishing with Latin, casting with Latin, man, that's a lot of fun. Ladies and gentlemen, today we're hiking up a pristine, beautiful cutthroat stream in southern Alberta. Hope you enjoy the show. I think it's going to be a great one. Stick around. We caught a glorious day in southern Alberta. Steve, did you see those fish? I do, and I saw one rise too. Hmm. Boy, it's a nice hole. Yeah, it is. I see a couple fish down in the middle. Okay, yeah. I don't know if you see them anywhere yep. else. Yeah, I do. There's one on the left that looks pretty sizable. So. Well, I think I'll go down into here and come from below and work my way up. Okay, I'll just sit back and watch the show. Good luck. Okay, thanks. Oh boy, you gotta look. Mm, you got a fish. Got him. What you That's got. a nice trout. Nice trout, nice. It's a really nice trout. Beautiful, Steve. Yeah, it's a beauty. Woo, that was awesome. Yeah, let's get that guy in. Yeah. Steve methodically worked the powerful fish toward him then made the scoop. Nice, oh that's a beauty. Boy, it's a beautiful 16 inch cutthroat. Took the dry fly, big fat Albert. And uh, awesome, beautiful fish. Nice cutthroat. That was gorgeous. It's so cool seeing these fish in here. You can see them on the bottom. Uh -huh. But And uh, when they come up, though, you're seeing them come up from so far, it's hard to not pull it right out of their mouth or away from them. Yeah. And I think the first couple I missed, I pulled it out too fast. Well, there's nothing better than nice cuts and oh, small water. Man, it's incredible. We headed upstream in search of new waters. Ooh, this could be a good hole right oh, here. Oh, yeah. I like that. There we go. Nice. Yeah, it got down deep, and boy, you could came up and slammed it pretty good. Nice little cutthroat. Oh, lost him. Shoot. Darn it. That was pretty cool. The mountains of southern Alberta are spectacular. I kind of like a little spot just like this. I mean, the water's really low. This uh, river's had a lot of pressure lately. So some of these spots like this are a little bit obscure. They could hold fish. Yeah. All right. Nice. Oh, boy. oh, yeah. Nice trout. Thanks. Right wow. underneath that log. Yeah. That was cool. That's a hot fish. It is a hot fish. Woo! Look at that thing fight. Yeah. Ugh. I don't want him to go back in there. That's pretty exciting. Yeah, that's awesome. Ah. Oh. It's a good size yeah, trout. Yeah, it is. It's good for a hole that size. Yeah. I actually, I should say it is. Come on, guy. Don't want to mess around. Oh, yeah, it's a beauty. Gotta take him yeah, more line. Yeah. 
Okay. Got rolled up in the dropper a little bit. Oh, nice, nice. cut. Nice. Right underneath this log. Yeah. And you thought, maybe there's a fish there. I tried several casts. I finally skipped one underneath that log, and sure enough, it was there. Awesome. Very cool. Oh, look at this gorgeous fish. Look at that. Oh, yeah. It's just beauty. Nice cutthroat. Oh, man, that's a lot of fun. Yeah, boy, you, you don't know whether to expect the fish under there, but that kind of goes to show you don't want to overlook these little small opportunities. So, Very cool. All right, let's go get some more. Yeah, let's do it. Yeah. All right. Got him. It's a good one. Nice. Yeah, boy, you can see them right down there in that clear water. I'd like to keep them out of the main pool best I can. Oh, that's a nice trout. It is a nice trout. That's pretty exciting. Shoot. God. <sighs> oh, that's frustrating. So I got both my flies. I worked hard for that fish. You know, he's right in that back eddy. I could see him facing the opposite direction of the river. And I finally got it in position where he took it. And I saw him come grab it. Ah, <sighs> but I lost it. Evening was fast approaching. Yeah, it's All a right. good one, Steve. Nice. Connection, big fish, or good fish. I worked the cutthroat toward me. Oh yeah, whoa, it's a good one. It is a good nice. cut. Nice. <laughs> wow, that Oh awesome. boy, that's a fat yeah, fish. Yeah, it's a nice fat cut. Beautiful. Oh boy, he's ready to rock and roll. Oh yeah, that was an awesome fish. Steve gave me this little yellow emerger. Put that on, I'm telling you, three casts, that thing came up and pounded it. That's a fish for sure that I'm seeing. It's on the left-hand side of the riffle. Oh, well, actually it's moving back and forth in the riffle. Ooh. Ah, that was my fly. Gosh, I don't know how I missed it. it. Did I break it? Never felt it. Dog, got it. Got him. Oh yeah. Nice big, fish. Not, yeah, it's not a big one, but. That's still, it's, it's fine. It's a good fighter, yeah. It's awesome. Yeah, absolutely, cool. Oh, lost him. Oh, oh, got it. Got one. Good job, Steve. Love these cutthroats. Boy, they come up for dries. They're good fighters. Awesome fish. It's a good fish. Yep, it's a good fish. It was a fun take. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, it's a good, beautiful colors. Look at that thing. Mm hmm. Come on, baby. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, it's a good fish. Wow, it is. Yeah, nice. Wow. Woo. Beautifully colored cutthroat. Look at that thing go. Boy, I tell you what, that was pretty cool. Couldn't quite see the take. I just kind of kept a feel with the fly there and uh, hit it. Off it went. That was awesome. awesome job. Yeah, very cool. The tip of the week is brought to you by Northwest Outfitters, located at the village at Riverstone in Coeur d'Alene, Idaho. So on these hot summer days, uh, a lot of times you'll find fish tucked up in any shadow you can find. Even maybe it's not optimum depth, uh, maybe it's not optimum water temperature at some times, but uh, a lot of times if you can get uh, a fly presented into the shadow, they'll really seek those places out. Uh, so let's give it a shot, see what we can find if they're in there. There we go. It's a nice fish. Oh. Sucker. That might have been the fish of the day. I was going to say, how, where are you going to bring that through the current? The next day, we're back at it again. What do you think? I saw fish rise here as we 
Yeah. Came up to this hole. I have this little mayfly on, and uh, okay. Who knows? I've seen a couple little mayflies flying around. I don't know if it's the right color or not. But. Yeah, and they're supposed to be hatching this time okay. of year, so it's worth a shot, I think. And I'll I'll set up this with nymphs, and we can go through after dries. Sounds good. I'll okay. Get started. All right. Ooh. Oh. Oh, shoot. <laughs> Got way too excited on that one. Yep. <laughs> that one came that one came way out of the water. I'm going to try and get it over in that fast current. Let it drift down through. Got one. All right. Hey, I was just down there. Yeah, it was pretty cool. I cast out in that faster water. Oh, yeah. I was just getting ready to pick it up. It was right down in here, and I could see him come up and oh, take awesome. it. Oh, awesome. And it was on the nice dry. Slow. Yeah, on the dry. That's it's like a, a decent fish. Mayfly. Too. Yeah, it's a nice trout. It's a nice trout. Oh, cut boy, throw. it is. Let's get this guy. Oh, yeah. Oh, boy. Oh, wow. Oh, beautiful fish. Yes. Beautiful cut. Whew. Wow. That's a way to start the day. <laughs> That's fine. This water is cold Turn sideways too. just a bit. Oh, Boy, I tell you what, that's a fat, healthy cut for Yeah, that's you know, awesome. Nice girth to it. Incredible. Yeah, that's so cool. Whew. Right up against that rock, you said. Yeah, well, so I cast against that rock, see where the swifter current is. Right. But the fly drifted nicely all the way down, and it picked it up right in here. Wow. I was just getting ready to, you know, pick it up and cast, and I see this body come oh, up. Oh, awesome. Slipped it really slow. Yeah. That's cool. It was. This is a fly that I caught that fish on. It's a nice pale mayfly, pale morning done. And hopefully that'll work to catch a few more fish today. It did, did get it, yeah. All right, little nice guy, job, I think. Steve. Thanks. Yeah, definitely Good a fish. guy. But cool take. Nice little cutthroat. Beautiful fish. <laughs> and there it goes. That was fast. I'm sure it probably didn't show on film. It was about a 12 inch cutthroat. Beautiful fish. You see that right? Was that a rise? I'm not sure, but it looks good in there. You think yeah. you saw one? Yeah, I think I saw one. All right, I'm gonna try it. Remember to set the hook softly. Soft hook set. Soft. Got him. Oh! Good try. <laughs> you still got a fly? <laughs> yep. Still All right. Got a fly. Maybe there's another one in there. Maybe he'll get his big brother to come up. This has been a great pool. I've had three or four big cuts come up from my dry fly. Unfortunately, I didn't hook any of them. Fish. Got one? Fish. Awesome. Yeah. That's good news. I'm a nymph. Yeah. Yeah, it looks like a good one. I could see the fish in the clear water, and I finally had a chance to get on the board. Gosh, dang it! We moved upstream. Steve, I do see a really good spot right up against Ooh, yeah, that, that cliff at deep good. water, yeah. Oh yeah, it's a good All right. fish. Nice. It's awesome. a weighty fish. Whoa! Whoa! Where'd he go? Oh, oh! Almost caught Steve. <laughs> <sighs>
Got All it. All right. Nice. I tell you, and that strong current, that thing felt like a four pound fish. <laughs> it's a good one. Yeah, that's cool. All right, it's a nice cut. That fast current. It's on the Copper John. Make sure he's good and revived. I guess I don't have to because that thing was ready to rock and roll. Yeah, it was. Yeah, <laughs> that was fun. Just cast out in this uh, fast current near this rock and just felt the tug, and that was a fun fight. Yeah, good job. Thanks. You want to show the setup, the nymph that it's catching it on? Sure. This is a fly I caught it on. It's just a tiny size 16 Copper John, and uh, it's a fun fight. Oh yeah. Nice. Oh boy. The big fish headed downstream. Oh! My gosh! Wow. I've never seen a cut jump like that in my life. Wow. We're falling. And I don't have that cutthroat on anymore. That was a big fish. Did you see that? I didn't I missed it, yeah. no. He saw it. Clint that thing it. jumped three feet out of the water. Well, maybe it wasn't a cut, huh? Yeah, it was a cut. It was a cut. It was, a cut it first was just a huge colors? cut. It was big. Oh, oh my gosh. I just hooked probably the biggest cutthroat I've ever had on in a river in my life. Ran downstream toward those boulders, jumped, snapped my tippet, and it's gone. It was fun. But I got to admit, I'm just a little bit disappointed. Have you ever noticed that Ladin never loses a small fish? It's always a huge fish? Well, this time, I have to agree, that was a huge fish. So that was a little higher than the yeah. last one, so there might Work be a couple, yeah. or it could be the same fish, but that time I thought it looked like a bigger fish. So. Yeah. Try it? Yeah. Go for it, man. I think so. I think I'll kind of wade in, try and stay right below it. Okay. See if I can get a good cast right, to it. All right, good luck. Thanks. Okay. Ooh! Dang it. Heavens! That was a nice fish. That was a good fish. Darn it. It moved just as it was going after it. Gosh, that was a nice for fish. There we go. Awesome. All right, yeah. Steve, awesome. Cool. Fun the hopper? Yeah, I think so. It's not a big guy, but he came rocking it out of there. That yeah, cool. that's cool. There you go. Good quick release. Yep. <laughs> Probably should have had a little more line out there. When you first get to a hole, you want to start shallow. Wade shallow, cast shallow, you'll catch more fish that way. The McGansers were enjoying their time on the river as well. So sometimes fishing gets a little slow and Ladin and Steve, they will split up and make it hard for me to follow them with the camera. So I have to just follow one of them. I'm Von Steve and all of a sudden Ladin starts yelling he's got a fish. There we go. But it is in fact a fish and I'm happy. Come on little guy. There she goes. Fish. All right, fish. So I got to run up the river to get to Ladin, and he's got a six inch fish. Oh, got him. All right. That looks like a good one. Yeah, it's a nice fish. What was it on, Steve? I think he came up on the hopper. Got him. Oh boy, that's a nice trout. That's wow. Look, look at that baby. Wow. That's a nice trout. That is a really nice trout. Oh man. Oh wow, that was awesome. Yeah, that was a nice fish. Yeah. Came up, 
right out of here. Uh huh. And, you know, you can see really well now, so I could see the thing come up. Yeah. It was a nice fish. Yeah, this is the spot we hit earlier today and had some success. So. Yeah, mostly in the bottom of the hole, so I really wasn't expecting too yeah. much, but boy, it well, slammed it. it yeah. was, I was surprised. It was yeah. great. That's awesome. All right, it's been a heck of a day, Steve. It sure has. We get out of here. Yeah, sounds good. It's going to be a beautiful sunset tonight, I think. Yeah. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I hope you enjoyed the show, and please join us next week for more Fishing with Ladd. Be sure to join us next time for more Fishing with Ladd, because we're having fun catching fish.